Yes, I know his name's Dean. Did I ever tell you what the definition of insanity is? Hello there, it's I, the Geordie Nerd, and I am back again with more Venture Bros. I'd like to apologise to everybody. Um, I wasn't feeling all that great last week, so I couldn't get any videos out, but I'm going to get two Venture Bros episodes out this week, um, today, and I believe I said tomorrow on Patreon, but uh, yeah, so, sorry about that. Um, link is down below for the Patreon if you want to help support the channel. Uh, chuck in a buck and you get full unedited access to these reaction videos. I also have a Facebook page. Um, stick that down below too if you want to check that out. Um, and yeah, I think that's pretty much it. Let's just stop waffling and and watch the show. That's it. Just like that. Easy. Go back a bit. God, you're right on top of me. Can't help it. It's... Doc, maybe I should lube this thing up before we take it down. <laughs> It'll be fine. It's not built for speed. It's built for deep penetration. Uh, That's what she said. <laughs> I'm 34. Yeah, I'm not 33 anymore. It was my birthday on the 17th. Oh, I'm 34. All right, that's it. You promised no penetration jokes. Oh, come on. Look at that thing. How can I resist? It's practically a monument to my father's repression. You want me to turn this thing around? <laughs> Fine, spoil sport. All right. Keep it moving. You do it fine. Oh, shit. Zach, what's going on? Am I clear or what? Oh, the hell, Doc. Now, ain't you? Oh snap, Doc. <laughs> oh. You okay down there? Are we gonna need a clone of Doc now? Oh, so we had calling him Doc, I usually call him Rusty. Two. One. Doc. Doc, you down there? What the hell? What the f fudge? Can't swear this at the start of the video because it'll get demonetized, so. What is going on? Oh. Holy crap, you're not a rat. And you're not Dr. Venture. Oh, no, 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 no. You closed it. Why would you do that? It was an accident. What? It, this is a nuclear fallout shelter. What See, the fudge? The channel, it's like they what is going on? They've got many people in a f Welcome back to the Venture Bros, Paul. I have been known to engage in impromptu daring do from time to time. Without us? Can you think of even one place on Earth they wouldn't drag us along to? Hey, look at this! It has a giant centipede scar. Besides, the X-1's still in the hangar, <laughs> and we had plans today. Fair Why didn't I get to see that? Oh, that's brilliant. Look, you're so freaking clever. How'd you get your little ass stuck in here the first time? Ah, uh, well, as with all juicy science fiction tales, this one starts with an accident. We were testing the system, something went horribly wrong, and Jonas abandoned the project. End of story. Would have been nice <laughs> if he didn't taken a last look around. That was compelling. That, that was a good story. Hey, there's no one left to talk to. You, you, you could talk to the ants? Oh, you don't actually talk to them. That would be silly. They, they wouldn't have anything to say anywhere. They'd be, hey, let's eat and have sex with this us size guy. Yeah, that, yeah don't talk to the ants. Because, one, you'll sound insane. Or two, they'll talk back and that's probably a sign you are insane. But in this show, they probably do talk. A triad, a symbol, a symbol. My stories are all. Where the sucker? Where the sucker? Can't hide from the blood eye, baby. I'm on. That is so cool. I would love a spin-off with this character killing vampires, man. It's just he's he's basically Blade, isn't he? Like that's how cool he is. Order of the triad, a symbol. Damn it, Orpheus! I almost had that blood sucker. Oh. Now I got the blue balls in my blood eye. My apologies, ain't <laughs> But the order of the triad is unique. Now I got the blue balls in my blood eye. Oh, whew, that's good. <laughs> Some sort of experiment, but why would he abandon it in such haste? He gets bored pretty easy. And rarely tidies his work area. Hey, do you think maybe, you know, I'm going to go out on a limb here. They went down there? 
You, you oh. mean you didn't check? Are you kidding? That's like the basement. It's super <laughs> spooky down there. <laughs> oh, no. I mean, he said it himself. He was attacked by a giant centipede. The week before it was a wear a dial. I mean, yes, that wasn't real, but still, they're scared to go down to the basement. But all the stuff that happens to them on a weekly basis oh, that's brilliant! God, I love Hank and Dave. Yes, I know his name's Dean. Slight's fancy, yes, the little imps have certainly skylarked us into quite a mare's nest this time. <laughs> Skinny one thinking he has a shot with his daughter. Now that's an act of imagination. Are you finished? <laughs> <laughs> Let us try to get... Oh, poor Dave. I mean, he might. You, you, you don't know. He might have a slight chance with that. A psychic lock on them. I will shine like a bell. <laughs> I'll get a spell unveiling. I'll, um, shed for blackulas. <laughs> No, no <laughs> I tried. He won't stand still for two seconds. It's probably spaced up on yellow jackets. <laughs> I'm trapped in a sewer with a gun. That's not a geek pop. What's his name, man? I'm such a tit. Oh, I've forgotten his name now. But yeah, I know who it is. But I thought for a split second it was Iggy Pop, but Iggy Pop had hair. But just this once, if you show me how to get back and you keep to the kitchen area, I'll allow you to come up for a while as a reward. <laughs> what do you think, Rusty? We should let Father decide. We should let Father decide. Why they all called Rusty? Are they like super fans of Rusty? Let me tell you something about the whole in hand can lift a hundred times its own weight business. It's a myth, okay? How much do you think an ant actually weighs? Uh, like nothing? What's nothing times a hundred? Nothing. It's nothing! Is that true? No, no, no. Oh shit, what the hell's that? Mother. Well, that's not scary at all, except it is. Like Christ. Mother, no, they're blowing full. Nuclear arsenal. Oh shit, the bed! That is. Yep, that's going to be scary. You are in the presence of the father. <laughs> oh, father. A non-Rusty has entered our midst. We're right to bring him here, Rusty. So they're all Rusty. Every single one is Rusty. And he's the real Rusty and they don't believe it. The burden of preserving the American way of life in a post-nuclear world is upon you. Controls flyaways, but it looks and smells great. Not too smooth, even what the fudge is going on? This is this is the weirdest episode yet, but it's brilliant. But what is going on? Contamination, contamination. Oh shit! Okay, okay. I think I've got something. Maybe it's all. Just a dream? <laughs> well, you're the one who read <laughs> this, so let's go get him. Yes. Yes, let's let's go get him. Scared of a computer screen. It looks like something from Day of the Tentacle or Maniac Mansion from the Nintendo days. I loved that game. It was really, really good. <laughs> Classical orchestra. Yes, sir. Old Jonas Lotto. Just about him. What the hell? So... It's kind of like a Fallout game. Where it's like an experiment on people. So yous are all gonna leave all those people, you absolute scumbag. <laughs> oh my god, that's horrible. They've been down there all that time. Jesus. Oh my god. Did you know I also raised carrier pigeons on my roof? <laughs> the stuff you don't know about me could fill a book. Quickly, Mr. Samson, we haven't a moment to. Oh, did you sculpt him yourself? <laughs> <laughs> no, he's my little friend, Wayne. I don't know why I called him Wayne. That's never good, is it? Can he just jump off? Ah, 
Oh god, that's so bad. John 316. <laughs> Go team venture. Oh, that's that's brilliant. This episode's so fucking stupid, but it's brilliant. <laughs> oh, that was that was that was a good that was a good episode. It was really, really funny. Alright, let's check this final scene. They've been using it as a bathroom. But if they sent all their waste into the sky, father would make Oh, it that's disgusting. Honorary gold members of the Rusty Venture Fan Club. Which explains why they had the canny survival skills to live down there for so long. Yeah, one bright day back in 1978, my father... I love how he's shot in the men. <laughs> oh, Rusty, you are a scumbag. An old scope of Tony, a dad? Not entirely. Somehow they were able to get VH1 classics on that thing, too. <laughs> you know, cable wires got somewhere. So what about Mother? Where is Dr. Venture? Don't worry, I found him. He's right here. And uh, he wants to talk to you, too. <laughs> oh, hello, Rusty. No, Dr. Venture. It's Mother. You're looking well. And... <laughs> Oh, that's good. That's clever. Join your new life below ground. No, Doctor Venture. We have much to talk about. Ha -ha, good. Because today <laughs> good. I'm talking about personal hygiene. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, this was a very, very weird episode, but I really did enjoy it. It was super, super fun. Oh, this show, it's just so unpredictable, but that's what I love about it. It's just so funny. And that's not Iggy Pop, and it's really, really bothering us who it is. Oh, God's sake. Where's my phone? I'm not going to Google it. I'll Google it when I'm done. But, yeah, um, Twisted Fire Startup. For a brief second, I thought it was Iggy Pop, but no, it's not. Um, but, yeah, this episode was weird, wonderful, and wacky, which, which is every episode of The Venture Bros., um, and that's what I love about this show. It's just so unpredictable. It's just so funny. Um, I love the triad. I want more of the triad. Like I said, the, the um, Blackula dude, if he had his own show, I think that would be pretty cool. Him hunting vampires, that would be awesome. But I would love a spin-off of the triad as well because they are such a weird and wonderful like group. They really are. Um, I'm good we didn't get to see the master um, because... That those scenes are always weird. Well, every scene's weird, Paul. But I love the guy who plays Archer. And to see him in this, that would have been pretty cool. Um, like, wondering what he was going to be this time. But never mind, I'm assuming he'll come back. Um, but yeah, this this has been a great episode. Super funny. I love the music style. The music, the art style, like, it's just brilliant in this show. But this music in this episode, it was very, like, 80s... Um, kind of reminds us a bit of the Warriors as well. I don't know if that was on purpose or not, um, with the music style and stuff. But uh, yeah, it was it was a brilliant episode. I really really did enjoy it. Uh, the writers on this, they're just fantastic. They they pull it out of the bag every episode. There's not been a bad um episode so far, and I've really really enjoyed it. Uh, so yeah, I'll I'll leave it there. Thank you very much for watching. I've been the Jordy Nerd. Like I said, the link down below for the Facebook. Um, if you want to drop a like when I get to 100 likes, I'm thinking maybe doing some sort of giveaway. Um, if you if you're interested, um, PlayStation, Xbox, points, Steam card, whatever. Uh, but yeah, I've been the Jordy Nerd. Thanks for watching. I'll see you all again very soon for more Venture Bros reaction videos.